Welcome back to Borrowed Boutique, I'm Frankie. Today we're doing an out-of-the-box episode with the Alien and Aliens figure. The uh, big chap and the Alien Warrior from NECA. Um, at a glance, I was looking at these and it appeared to be the same goddamn sculpt. And I know there's other ones out there that looked exactly like. That's why I was hesitant to buy these. Then a friend of mine off the Rebel Scum Facebook page was selling a bunch of his NECAs and I got these at a good price. So I decided to buy them because I love the big chat but I wanted to compare the two to see if they're really that close to being the same so let's open these bad boys up and see what's going so who do you guys like better do you like the the alien warrior design without the glass or do you like the big chap version the best I personally like the big chap hold on greeny Klippenstein anyway this is the worst part of the neck is all these bands that keep them in. Now this is awesome. There's an egg. That's really cool. I love these already. <laughs> Alright, what we got here? Get some tape. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, we got a face hugger. Tail don't really, tail bends a little bit. That's awesome. Ooh. Your mama's lasagna. Anyway, uh, oh, we got a chest burster. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's check this bad boy out. What do you got? There's more than two of these. Alright. Alright. <laughs> That's awesome. I've got to be careful with these. I know some NECAs break really easy. Oh, the tail is really, really, really cool. Nice. Really awesome. I just love the big chap so much. Oh, Something underneath. Oh, nice. Nice! It's a base for the for the egg. Like I said, I've never bought any of these before, so I don't... I hate to say it, but... I kind of dropped off when it comes to NECA. It's just I started doing model kits, and that's kind of what I want to do. But I still buy these. I don't know how that's supposed to go on. Two hours later. Hmm. I'll spend a whole video trying to get this set in there. Okay, there we go. Cool. So there's that. And he's big enough it looks like he's crawling out. I don't know if you can see that out. That is super rad. Alright, let's try the oh shit. Oops. Plasma! Dog plasma! Alright. Let's open the aliens. Alien warrior. It's pretty much the same damn thing. All right, no, it's a little different. Cool. The egg's different. That makes me happy. All right. So this egg out. Okay, this egg is already heavier. It doesn't have open bottom. I don't see a base for this one, so that's cool. And then again, we have. Another face hugger. Okay, this one's different. This is a different sculpt, which makes me happy. Really cool. All right. And then the chest burster. It looks different too. Nice. Oh, wow. That's really cool. Remember when Officer Leroy came in came in the alleyway? Remember what I told him? I said, yeah, whatever. <laughs> All right, this guy's cool. All right, let's look at the differences here. Obviously, the head sculpt. The body looks the same. The arms are different because the alien warriors have these little Duma bobs on here. 
and the big chap doesn't, but he's got the big points on the back of his elbow. Um, yeah, it looks like the torso is the same. The feet are different. He's got, you see the feet compared to this guy's gnarly. He's got like three toes as opposed to five toes. He's farther back on the evolutionary chain, I guess. They're both really cool. And I, I picked these up for my friend for 20 bucks a piece, so I was pretty happy with them. But uh, what can we say about aliens, right? It's the best. Giger just nightmare fuel. All right, this is pretty awesome. Cool. Well, there it is. Out of the box with the alien big chap and the alien warrior. Um, which one do you like better? I never get any comments like that, but I'll try anyway. <laughs> which you like better? I like the original the best, but that that's really rad. I think they're both rad. Xenomorphs Forever. I'm, I'm one of those few alien fans that I love every movie. I don't care what it is because if it don't quite fit in with the first two, Alien and Aliens, which to me is the, the definitive, that's the movies to watch. And uh, But I like Alien 3, but I mean that's one of those things where you could have 1 and 2 and then you could have one, two, and three, and that could be it. You know how they do that on on YouTube? They'll do the all the different timelines. Um, but I I like Alien Resurrection. I love Alien Resurrection. Sorry, Sigourney Weaver in leather pants. Come on, come on! But uh, I like both Aliens versus Predator. Um, the first one was kind of PG thirteen ish. Maybe it is PG thirteen ish. But I thought that was cool. And then. Uh, uh, Requiem is that the Aliens versus Pre the second Aliens versus Predator is balls to the wall and people I, people dog on it so bad and while I get it I love a movie that just is balls out the first thing you see is a dad and his son get face hugged that proves that nobody's safe in this and in fact nobody is safe but I just love it now, now the the, the Pred alien in that that's kind of nah I don't know about that that's a little wishy to me but it's still cool still an alien movie I love anything in that universe I'll take anything um, that's just how it is. I love it. So free your mind. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll show you uh, show you guys a, a better view of these if, so you can check them out. If you haven't bought any of these yet, please like and subscribe and check out my other socials. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Later. That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over.